So if you would like to find out how to do this makeup look for Halloween, stay tuned. Okay, so hi. How's it going? Right, so I'm going to turn myself into denim. I already have the mask done. First of all, I'm going to start off by painting the left side of my body black. So I'm going to start off by painting the left side of my body black, but I'm only going to do it like halfway down. I'm going to do like a few lines across to make it look as if it's not like it's all like dark, like teeth. Okay, so I'm using the Crayolan Aqua Color. These are one of my favorite paints to use. They're dead nice, they smell nice. And I'm running low on this. Okay, so I'm gonna give them the ears too. Okay, so all I've done here is the makeup on this side of my face because on this side of the face, this is where Venom's going. <laughs> okay, uh, what have I done with my booster? So I get the spoolie, disposable one, and then run this pretty stick the whole way through my eyebrows, get a good level. I actually really enjoyed the film. Me and my granny went to go see it. And this is him. And the mouth that all can move in it so that it can actually eat and talk. Because those are very important to me. Eating especially. I'm actually just going to take away a wee bit of the latex around his mouth because I think I've had it on. is isn't the most comfortable. Oh and by the way, this stinks. And I really, really do mean stinks with the smell of the latex, the smell of the gelatin. It's, it's just a vomit fest, just an absolute vomit fest. Okay, so all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put, uh, where are my teeth are going? I've literally only just stuck all a few of these teeth in with some prosade, so the better hurry up and stick. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get some prosade, put it all in the inside of here, and then stick that to my face. Do you know what? I'm actually with a very hurry face. And that's not the nicest thing to say, but I do. Um it's just all be like peach fuzz here. But can you do now? Right. 
Where am I even trying to dry that? Dry? Where am I trying to blow that dry for? Alright. Go. So, all I'm doing is I'm getting a cotton bud, dipping it into the pose aid, and then putting that all over. Do what I'm actually going to do, I'm actually going to put it on my face. A bit of it on my face and then glue this to my face because I'm going to end up with no hair. <laughs> so I just got my prosade from the Titanic Creative Management. It's placed in Belfast, they've got those training courses and they sell a good load of prosthetic makeup as well. Everybody works in a state nice. That's the place where I actually got my face cast done. Okay, so the thing about prosthetic, whenever you put it on you have to let it dry before you put your prosthetic on. Then otherwise it's just not gonna stick. This is actually good because it looks like there's a little bit of um, I kept kind of coming out the side of it.
And all I'm gonna do is let that basically run down me. So, oh shit. This is basically the finished look, and I. Oh, uh, no, stick. This is basically the finished look, and I am absolutely over the moon with it. Couldn't be happier. Delighted. Loving it. The only thing is, this mask is super heavy, so I couldn't really see anybody wearing it for too long on Halloween. Because um, it literally feels like it's just pulling down on the one side of my face. But I am actually loving this. Like, I really do. Right, so finished product, absolutely buzzing, couldn't be happier, and yes, so. It's okay to talk. This whole thing's basically connected. When you finally get rid of that parasite. That itch. Oh, fun and games. Ah, doing this. But, fuck. The removal process, not too fun. Holy Christ, holy Christ. Uh, I literally do be like I'm venom at the minute with all this. It's dead. 